Um, if you remember a few weeks ago, I told mm -hmm. you about the double-breasted, uh, you know, blazers and coats and how they're coming back. Today, I have something else to share, and this is all about a new trend, but it's an old trend, and this is platform shoes, in case you hadn't guessed that. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. They're very fun and stylish. Um, so what's the history of platform shoes, though, John? Okay, so Hollywood. Mm -hmm. Let's go back to Hollywood in the 1930s. Um, you know, there was a little bit of, uh, uh, there's a discussion about like who invented the platform shoe. Okay. Uh, Moisha Kimmel, maybe Ferragamo, but the point is that stars like Marlena Dietrich wore them. Um, and interestingly, Carmen Miranda and Mae West wore them because they were actually very diminutive in mm -hmm. stature and Mae West wore ginormous platforms that you couldn't see under her long gowns and Carmen Miranda you know not that anybody was looking at her shoes because of all that <laughs> fruit on top of her head and you know what people like read about these yeah. these women because they're like amazing but they they were the ones who started the whole platform craze okay. and Ferragamo even made a rainbow wedge platform for Judy Garland that ended up in the Metropolitan Museum of Art. Wow, so they were, you know, functional because women wanted to kind of look taller than they were, mm -hmm. but also very fashionable. But now this isn't the first time that platforms have had a renaissance, right? They've come and gone a few times. Right, and so, you know, we didn't see platforms until like the early 70s. Okay. And so, think back, okay, the Pointer Sisters and Bette Midler, when they first hit the scene, they were all about thrift shop vintage mm. dressing. And so they kind of revived the look. And David Bowie, on the other hand, he was, he had a different vision. His was like futuristic platforms, you know, kind of intergalactic. I like it. And Stevie Nicks, when Fleetwood Mac in the 70s became so big, mm -hmm. she got into a pair of platform shoes and she never took them off. I love it. She's still wearing them. <laughs> I love it. I'm not mad at that at all. So share more about these shoes that we have in front of us. Okay. Some are a little more intimidating than others, but they're all beautiful. So let's take a look at all of these amazing ones that I found at Macy's yesterday. Um, the, I think that these sort of extreme, kicky, fun ones, whether they're crystal beaded or, you know, a fun, funky color or this plaid pair that is an ode to the movie Clueless and the main character Cher. These are the kind of um, platforms that I think young people who haven't yeah. experienced the platform mm -hmm. trend before like could really have fun with. Right. You just kind of, you know, they're just, you just be bold in your platform. And have fun. Absolutely. Yeah. You can kind of see this transition, though, where, you know, they be, this, uh, you know what, this would look really good with my sweater. Um, just, uh, like, it does match. Oh, I got, uh, yeah, it's yeah. like, okay, interesting. Uh, but but if, as we move here, like, look at, this is a platform with a lug sole. This is, this is very, very practical, if you think about it. With all the snowfall that we had yesterday, a boot like this, you know, who needs to shovel? Yeah. <laughs> right? I know. Yeah. You could just, you let just me get a good shot of this because these are very, very beautiful. Yeah. But you're right. You just stomp over the snow. Yeah. You just you, you just traverse through. You know, you, who needs the the shovel? I like, the John plow? traverses. I stomp. So I like that. I like the way he puts everything. Okay. You have to, yeah. You have to like you know be elegant about it. Okay. Uh, let's go on to something that's kind of unexpected. The sandal. Okay. These are actually. For winter, you would wear a sandal like this, a flat form, so to speak, with like heavy tights and socks. And and then you can wear them literally 12 months a year because they transition into the summer. Like this pair with sequins, big trends for this year are daytime sequins and fur in warm weather. Mm. And then last but not least, you can see like the, the nude stiletto style here. If you want your legs to look long and lean, this is the shoe to wear. And then even that metallic one there, we can this hold nice. this up, yeah. right? I mean, anybody can wear this metallic platform. Yeah, this is it, nice. And I like the detail with like the little rhinestones right here on the buckle, just just a little something. Yeah, and if you think that they're, you know, that, that they're um, 
cumbersome. I would suggest, you know, going to a place like Macy's mm -hmm. and using a personal shopper like Brenda. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Brenda. Uh, and, tr you know, try them on. Mm -hmm. and, they, and that person can help you find the right style for us, the right height for us, right? Exactly. Yeah. It's, it, it is a look for everyone, as are many looks, if you interpret it the right way for yourself. That sounds awesome, John. Thank you so much. It's always like a learning lesson when we're together. It's this is important stuff. It is very important.